Nefertima visits the Beast Knight stables, where many rare animals reside. She then meets the captain of the Beast Knight Legion, Leston, and they introduce themselves to each other. Meanwhile, Leston recalls his conversation with Dan and how he described Nefertima as an extraordinary girl. Leston then takes Nefertima and Dan to see different animals and beasts. Nefertima meets Uwaz, who is known for his unfriendliness. Initially, he is very rude to Nefertima. But when Leston calls Uwaz selfish, Uwaz immediately starts to feel sad. However, Nefertima manages to cheer up Uwaz and easily becomes friends with him. While visiting the stable, a herd of boars comes after them, but Uwaz manages to scare them off. Nefertima thanks Uwaz, and he happily accepts. Leston starts to realize there's more to Nefertima than meets the eye. Leston also rides a bird called Wakas, which is supposed to be the fastest bird on land. He realizes that the Wakas is obediently following Nefertima's orders. Then, a hawk delivers an urgent message to Leston, so he heads back. After a while, they learn that a super rare breed of moose, a white moose, has escaped. They immediately decide to track it down. But after a while, in a sudden turn of events, Nefertima comes back with the white moose and Lars. Leston finally realizes that Nefertima has some kind of special powers. As an animal lover himself, Leston can't help but feel jealous of Nefertima. Finally, Nefertima's birthday arrives. She heads to the town to do some shopping taking Karna and Paul with her. When she returns from the city, everyone surprises her with a birthday party. Nefertima is so happy that she starts crying from happiness. Everyone, including the king, queen, prince, and three captains, is present. They all give her presents. Leston also gives her a baby hawk. After a while, Nefertima names the hawk Knox, 